Hello, my darling divas. It's your girl, Jazzy G G V 82 How are y'all doing today? And I hope by the time this video reaches you, you all are blessed and all are in the best of series. Marcus, say hi. How y'all doing? <laughs> That's my buddy, Marcus. <laughs> That's who y'all see in the picture on Facebook. He was all up in the business. Okay? <laughs> we be having a whole bunch of the fun. Okay? But anyway, um, I'm coming to you today. Yesterday, I did a review, the second review, and this is going to be the third one. Um... I went through hell and backwards trying to fix this hair because, like I said, no hair rules me. I rule the hair, okay? And I was going to make it work some way or somehow. Even though the hair is crap, and I'm going to say it, it's crap hair. And I'm, I'm not happy with it at all. I went through a lot of work. I stayed up last night trying to fix this hair, okay? What I did was um, I took it and I boiled it. I used some clarifying shampoo. After I did that, I put it in boiling water and I used snail slime. Yes, I use snail slime. I collect snails, okay? Don't judge me. Don't judge me. I use, yes, I collect snails. And <laughs> I have a lot of snails around my house, okay? So y'all know I, well, I live in a country. So, but around my house, I have a lot of snails. So what I do is I took the snot, because the slime has actual moisture in it, and it helps seal in the moisture into the hair. And as you can see, look at it. Let me, let me, let me turn around so y'all can see Y'all see that? This is what I did, okay? And um, I, I put the snail slime and I put a little bit of virgin olive oil in the boiling water, okay? Stirred it up until it got real hot. I dipped the hair, submerged the hair in there and I left it in there for about two minutes. Then I took it out and what I did was I rinsed it with, with, um, with cold water. And when I told you, when you use cold water, it basically locks the moisture in the hair, okay? So overnight, what I did was I used my homemade um, hair treatments that I do, and I put it in a Ziploc bag. I put it in the microwave for one minute. That was in the morning, but I left it in a Ziploc bag. And then the next morning, this morning, I put it in the microwave for one minute, and then I took it out and I left it open just a little bit. After I was done, I took it out. I rinsed it with cold water again so I can lock in more moisture into the hair. Once I was done, I put my, um, my Moroccan oil in there. Once I did my Moroccan oil, I let it air dry and then today as you can see i layer cut it and everything once after i was done and yes i we had to color we colored it yes so we used um we did a demi on it and so we did this on the scalp it, i mean it's not perfect but i mean it's better than it was yesterday as you saw that thing was so white and it looked so ill so it looks a lot better now so um now what i'm doing um so what i did was after i got dry and everything and i Flat ironed it straight. Yeah, I went through trials and tribulations with this hair. I flat ironed it straight. After I flat ironed it, I layer cut it. And I, I, I am a very, I'm a, I love to cut hair. Okay, and that's what I'm, that's what I'm good at. I love to cut me some hair and put layers in it and make it flow and make it look just, you know, slamming. So I did that and then I curled it with the curling iron and this is how I got this beautiful effect. Okay, so. The hair looks nice now and it feels great. The hair feels beautiful. I cut off a lot of hair, a lot, a lot of hair. But the hair feels great. There's no tangling. It's bouncy, it's flowing, it's moving. I mean, look at it, okay? But this was not, <laughs> this is not, Brizzy, here, 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 mom, you can comb, you get, get the combing, boo, get, get the combing, okay? Show them how it's done, boo, show them how it's done. Now, do I believe this hair was Brazilian? No, I don't believe it was Brazilian because with Brazilian hair, the hair is very, very thick. It's thicker than the Indian Remy hair. I think this is Indian Remy hair. I do not believe this is Brazilian hair. So I don't know what happened. Um, I'm not sure what happened, but like I said, the end result, I was able to fix it. Not everybody can do what I do, okay? But this is what I had to go through. So I, like I said, still at the end of the day, there's some customer out there who would have gotten this hair and wouldn't know nothing to do it, <laughs> wouldn't know what to do with it. And basically, I told you exactly what I did, and this is how I did. And an alternative, you can use honey. You could put honey in your boiling water with virgin olive oil and some coconut oil inside your boiling water, okay, if you don't want to use a snail slime. I know, ladies, but this is just something that I do. I'm Haitian, okay? We we, 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 we do home rim. This is all we do, okay? And we make things work. That's, that's, that's our culture. This is what we do, okay? We believe in making, making stuff work, and that's what we do, okay? So big up to all my Haitian sensations out there, all right? Um, I hope you, I hope you all have a wonderful blessed day, and I hope that y'all like the end result of this hair. Even though I went through a lot of trials and tribulations trying to fix it and stuff, but I'm sorry, Mark. Did I get in your hair? Don't worry about it. Hit me with this, though. Mm. Hit me, hit me, one more time. Woo! All right. Now. Hold on, let me care so we don't <laughs> flip off my head. <laughs> all right, my darling divas. I will talk to y'all soon. And um, so this was the last 
review and this is the last update and the hair came out beautiful it's fine now i can wear it and i'm still not happy about the, what happened but like i said i made it into something and now i can wear now it's wearable and i can rock it all right so you all have a wonderful blessed day marcus tell them bye 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 y'all <laughs>